This introduction to the larynx and hyperpharynx was created by Beyond 5 for the benefit of patients and families affected by laryngeal and hyperpharyngeal cancer. The larynx or voice box does three important things. It makes sound, voice, so you can talk, lets air into the lungs when you breathe, and helps stop food going down into the lungs when you eat and drink. The larynx is made up of cartilage. Its main parts are the upper part, called the supraglottis, the middle part, called the glottis, and the lower part, called the subglottis. The supraglottis contains a flap of tissue called the epiglottis that prevents food from spilling into the voice box and entering the lungs and causing infection. The glottis contains the vocal cords which open when breathing and close when talking and swallowing. The subglottis is directly below the vocal cords where the larynx joins the trachea or windpipe. Cancer that starts in any part of the larynx is called laryngeal cancer. Cancer of vocal cords can also be called glottic cancer. Surrounding the larynx is a horseshoe shaped part of the throat called the hypopharynx, which leads into the esophagus, the food pipe or gullet. The parts of the hypopharynx that lie on either side of the larynx are called the piriform sinuses. They are like funnels that channel food into the food pipe. Cancer that starts in the hypopharynx is called hypopharyngeal cancer. The larynx and the hypopharynx make sure that food and liquids go down the right way. When you swallow, the epiglottis and the vocal cords close tightly to block food entering the windpipe. The vocal cords are controlled by the laryngeal muscles and nerves which can be damaged by cancer of the larynx and hypopharynx. Cancers of the larynx and hypopharynx may cause a hoarse voice because they affect how the vocal cords move, cause difficulty swallowing or breathing because they block the passage of food and air, and finally they may allow food and liquids to enter the windpipe causing you to cough or develop chest infections because the vocal cords don't close properly. We call this aspiration when food or water gets down to the lungs. Laryngeal cancer and hyperpharyngeal cancer can be treated with surgery or radiotherapy. Surgery may be combined with radiotherapy and radiotherapy may be combined with chemotherapy. Depending on the size and the location of the cancer, your specialist will suggest treatment options that are suitable for you. For further information, please visit www.beyond5.org.au.